In this video, I'm going to be taking a look at how much data it takes to stream your favorite music from your music streaming service of choice. So in my case, I use Google Play Music. You can see it in my doc, Play Music. I use that just because it comes with YouTube Red and I love YouTube Red and it just worked out. Anyway, first up, make sure there's no other apps that could be using data. Yep, that's all taken care of. Now I'm gonna go to Settings, Cellular. You can see I have uh, some data usage for my YouTube test, which will be linked below. I'm gonna reset the data statistics. Now I'm at zero bytes of data. So now I'm just gonna to go to the Google Play Music app and stream some music. Now, when I was first thinking of this video, I was like, wait a minute, what can I stream? You know, I listen to a lot of songs on today's biggest hits. I have those downloaded for offline playback, a lot of dance music, a lot of the popular songs already downloaded. What am I gonna play? What am I gonna be able to stream? And then I was like, aha country music. So I actually personally don't really like country music and as a result I have none of it available for offline playback so I know when I play today's country hits all of it will be streamed. So I'm gonna play this for 30 minutes. I'm gonna set that up and I'm gonna get my timer going. So I've got a 30 minute timer. I'm gonna play the music and I'm gonna start my timer. I'm gonna see how much data this uses over the next 30 minutes. been exactly 30 minutes so I'm going to stop streaming country music and I'm gonna stop the timer and I'm gonna to go to the settings app and just see how much data Google Play Music was able to use in the last 30 minutes. You can see my current period is 46.5 megabytes of data. If I scroll down to the Play Music application, you can see the actual usage was 42.1 megabytes of data, which is just about 100 megabytes per hour. That means one gig of cellular data will give you 10 hours of audio playback when you are streaming music. Now I do recommend downloading your music for offline playback, but if you don't have any music or you'd like to stream some, it's not actually going to use up a significant amount of data. Again, you can stream about one hour of music and only use about 100 megabytes of data. So if you have to, you can. Although, again, I recommend downloading music for offline playback. So thank you very much for watching this video and I'll see you next time.